Good morning and welcome to today's daily reading. This morning we're going to read together Psalm 40 and it's a psalm which I think brings great hope and comfort especially if we're experiencing uh, trials. This is what the word of the Lord says. I waited patiently for the Lord and he inclined to me and heard my cry. He also brought me up out of a horrible pit, out of the miry clay, and set my feet upon a rock, and established my steps. Hallelujah. He has put a new song in my mouth. Praise to our God. Many will see it and fear, and will trust in the Lord. Blessed is that man who makes the Lord his trust, and does not res uh, respect the proud, nor such as turn aside to lies. Many, O Lord my God, are your wonderful works, which you have done, and your thoughts toward us cannot be recounted to you in order. If I would declare and speak of them, they are more than can be numbered. Sacrifice and offering you did not desire. My ears you have opened. Burnt offering and sin offering you did not require. Then I said, Behold, I come. In the scroll of the book it is written of me. I delight to do your will, O oh my God, and your law is within my heart. I have proclaimed the good news of righteousness in the great assembly. Indeed, I do not restrain my lips. O Lord, you yourself know, I have not hidden your righteousness within my heart. I have declared your faithfulness and your salvation. I have not concealed your loving kindness and your truth from the great assembly. Do not withhold your tender mercies from me, O Lord. Let your loving kindness and your truth continually preserve me. For innumerable evils have surrounded me. My iniquities have overtaken me so that I am not able to look up. They are more than the hairs of my head. Therefore my heart fails me. Be pleased, O Lord, to deliver me. O Lord, make haste to help me. Let them be ashamed and brought to mutual confusion who seek to destroy my life. Let them be driven backward and brought to dishonour who wish me evil. Let them be confounded because of their shame who say to me, Aha! Aha! Let all those who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. Let such as love your salvation say continually, The Lord be magnified. But I am poor. And needy. Yet the Lord thinks upon me, You are my help and my deliverer. Do not delay. Praise God. Praise God that the Lord does not withhold his tender mercies towards us, but his loving kindness and his truth is what preserves us. I love that verse which says, uh, Many, O oh Lord my God, are your wonderful works, your thoughts uh, which you have done, and your thoughts towards us cannot be recounted in order. They're more than can be numbered. That is the vastness of his love and his mercies towards us. Hold on to that promise today and may the Lord be with you and bless you as you place your trust in him. See you tomorrow and we will continue reading our Psalms together uh, very soon. God bless you.